because nobody has been talking about that before. Um, the other thing is that um, um, cocoa has an impact on climate change. And you can actually calculate the carbon footprint of a cocoa supply chain. Now, people, especially consumers in, in, in Europe and in the United States, and probably also in Australia, are paying more and more attention to the carbon footprint prints of the things they consume. And more and more people say, we only want to buy things that come from close to where we live, because then the carbon footprint is low. So how can they buy cocoa if they're in Europe, if they want to buy from a small radius around their village? Not possible. So how can you sell cocoa if you are so far away from the consumer market? Carbon footprint of your supply chain will become important. And this also includes the shipping and so on. But the advantage is that if you calculate the carbon footprint